Hi everyone, my name is Stephanie Velasquez, and I will say my experience with public speaking is actually pretty moderate. I just graduated from high school and I was very involved with clubs and sports. I was actually the captain of my tennis team, so I would say I got a pretty good first-hand experience with public speaking as I would speak to my teammates, try to motivate them, kind of be sort of their mentor, so that was a kind of everyday thing. And also in these clubs, it was actually a big requirement for most of them to do a presentation. So I got to really exercise public speaking. I want to say I'm an expert though, but it really did get me far. High school is a pretty good experience for me to actually socialize, but public speaking, I would say I'm not so well with it, but I have gotten better. And also, I had a real first experience with public, public speaking, I would say, as my job actually chose me to advertise them at a bridal convention center not too long ago, probably a month ago. So I had a chance to go to George R. Brown Convention Center and actually advertise and try to speak to people, try to have them come over to see the club, be a potential customer. So I feel like that was actually a pretty big step to my public speaking experience. Also, some things that you might not know about me is that I'm actually the youngest from two older brothers that I have, and I'm a little baby girl. I would say that I'm not, I don't see myself as spoiled, but maybe that might be so. And I was, as a kid, I was actually very enthusiastic, and I feel like I still am. It was important where I wasn't, but I feel like every kid goes through that. But as I was actually at UHD, because that is where I'm going, I was thinking about how I got to my own career path, and I'm actually majoring in management information systems. So when it actually came to my realization in middle school that I had to kind of start picking these classes for high school and everything like that, I went back to an experience that I had when I was seven or eight. My mom actually got operated in Mexico because she, she would go visit there a lot, and she gets her medical stuff done over there. She was actually in home all the time because she was still recovering. And my neighbor and I decided to make mangonadas, which is just mango popsicles. And we started selling these things. So my mom got mad at me. She found out somehow. Someone snitched on me. But that made me realize that I actually wanted to pursue business because as a kid, I just feel like I had that motivation. And, and it's just something that I really found my interest in. So there's more things to my childhood that I could explain to y'all. But those are just a few things of what I experience to who I want to be in the future and as everyone everyone wants to make money but anyway that is my video and I hope y'all enjoyed it thank you